automatically can see that we're trying to find this angle and I have a right triangle. Now, many of you may think that I did not have the opportunity to be exposed to trigonometry in Algebra 3-4 because of our stay at home with COVID-19. When you see these little negative ones, this is the inverse trig functions. Inverse trig functions allow us to find the measure of an angle in a right triangle provided two of the sides. So I have two sides and I have a right triangle. I can figure out this angle. Sokotoa helps me remember that sine is opposite over hypotenuse, cosine is adjacent over hypotenuse, and tangent is opposite over adjacent. From this angle, 10 is opposite. 10 is opposite. And 26 represents the length of the hypotenuse of the right triangle. So I'm working with the sine function. Again, we can find the angle measurement using inverse trig functions. So sine is opposite 10 over 26. And our correct answer is F.